Hey, Marv, just looking just slightly ahead to the weekend yep. with Cincy coming in and Cronin and all that, what kind of atmosphere do you anticipate? Yeah, I haven't thought about it much. I've just kind of been focused on Valpo. Um, we've got a couple games, or a couple days, you know, in between to get ready for, for Mick and his crew. But I kind of know who they are. I know their, their toughness, and I know their, their um, the full court press and the way they press and the way they play you in the half court or challenging with the matchup. Uh, it's not really a matchup. They have, they have a zone type of, uh, I'll call it matchup for lack of a better word, but they, it's, it's really uh, uh, can cause issues if you're not ready for it. So we're going to jump right into preparing for them. But as far as the the anticipated outcome of uh, attendance and stuff, you know, I don't I don't worry about those things. I'm not sure. I would hope, you know, for all our games, we, we continue to play the type of basketball that people are going to want to start to come out and, and start to support. You know, there's been so much uh, that has gone on here uh, at UNLV throughout the years that when I wasn't around, um, that I can't control, right? I, I, I don't, I have no, there's nothing I can do about the past, you know? Uh, but all I can do is, is, is have a great day today and, and have a plan for tomorrow. And I think we're doing that, and I think we're doing it at a high level. Um, I know we'll get critiqued and, and picked apart on every single pass and play, and, and that's okay. That's what I've signed up for. I, I realized the challenges when I took the job. So I'm, I'm in a great place. I'm in a great place about a foundation, and, and I'm hoping that the fans uh, that, are, that maybe left the program um, or are teetering on when they should come out or if they should come out, I, I, I think this is a very basketball-savvy town. And I think they will. Uh, I think they will see uh, what uh, what we have in place as they keep keep their eye, you know, one corner of their eye looking at what are the rebels doing over there. And and as we start to have more success on the court, obviously we're doing a lot of things off the court with our academics and and uh, you know community service things like that. But people want to people want you to win, right? They want you. But we're going to do it in a way where we sustain it. And uh, hopefully, I can, you know, end my career here. Uh, uh, I don't know that I'll ever be Tark. <laughs> that, might, that might be a little bit too lofty, but I do want I do want people to look back on my legacy here and go, you know, Coach Menzies did a really good job for us. So that's why I work, work for it.